Today I'm doing a swap out for this uh, exhaust cutout. I got a three inch exhaust cutout. I've replaced it once already with a new electric cylinder because the electric motor died. You hit open. You can see it in there, right? Let's turn some lights on. Yeah, you hit close. Closes, right? Now I'm hitting open, it won't open. Yeah, there it goes. Now I hit close. Kind of hangs up and moves weird. It's just cheap. So I decided to disassemble my old one and make it cable operated. Before I show you that, look how thin and cheesy the wires are for this thing. And it's got to be remote and you got to plug it into your cigarette lighter. That's cheap. So I decided to disassemble my old one and uh, get some little parts and make a cable operated one. Look at this. Boop. Open. Zoop. Close. And this thing locks. So you just twist it a couple times. You can lock it in whatever position you want so it sounds however you want it to sound. And that's just a locking throttle cable. Uh, I think this is off of a Edelbrock carburetor and this is just a piece of stainless steel that I drilled out. I was trying it through the side but it didn't work. So we'll see how it works on the car, see how hard it is to open and close once it's installed. Seems fine right now. Okay, so I got all this stuff out. It seems to work alright. Let's have a listen, shall we? Ah, I think it's pretty cool.